Hey guys, I am back with my another video and this is the fourth video about our playlist deploy applications. If you are new in this channel then don't worry. In this series I showing you multiple options on which you can host and deploy your websites or applications. In previous video I showed you Netlify Heroku and Expo CLI and today I am introducing you Vercel. Basically Vercel is a cloud platform for front-end frameworks. In this video I will give you each and every necessary information that you have to know but if you want to get more information then I will provide the documentation link in the description. Now there are two ways to deploy your project first is you can click on new project then link this platform with your github then you can simply import your any repository and perform these three steps create a team configure project and then deploy but in this video i'll show you the steps that you perform locally through your machine to deploy your project now without wasting any time, let's open our project. So this is the Netflix clone that I made using React framework and I already posted a video on this project. So link is in the description. First to deploy it, you have to open your terminal. Then install Vercel globally inside your machine with this command npm install versal g here dash g is for global after the installation write versal login inside your project and i want to continue with my github account so if you are using versal first time then you have to create account in versal website but I already have account so I log in with this github. After the github authentication done successfully, simply write versal and they'll ask you multiple questions. You can answer all of them by pressing enter and they'll take by default value. This is my github username by pressing enter all of the time now my project is uploading press enter again so here our project is building and they'll take some time so i want to speed up this process here you can see our production part is done successfully and our project is deployed this is the by default link that Vercel provide us. Now let's open our website and you can see guys it looks amazing. After seeing this if a question arrived in your mind that can I change something inside my website that is already deployed then the answer is yes. If you want to change something then you have to simply open your project like i want to change these films to movies then save open your command prompt here versal dash dash plot now it is fetching the change that we have done recently inside our project it will take some time so I want to speed up this process. Again our production part is done successfully. Then open your website and refresh it. You will see the changes automatically like I changed recently films into movies. So this is it guys for today's video. In this video we learn how to deploy our project using Versal and how to change it after the deployation if you like this video then give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you and bye bye